Bitch, I'm a big gun toter. Been thugging in these streets, hoe with a hole in your melon, nigga. For fucking with my people, got bodies and choppers. You might be another sequel. This is how I'm popping. That gang broke in Bitch, we bracking all stars. Those zero. And we're back again. What's up to the Stoner family? What's up, YouTube? What's up to everybody out there? How y'all doing? Hope everybody having a blessed day, wonderful day, whatever. Happy New Year. I know it's the day after New Year, but Happy New Year to y'all. Uh, hope y'all stay safe, because y'all know I've seen a lot of people got hurt or died that day. So, uh, yeah. So, on with the story times, all right? So, uh, I done already told y'all the other little stories y'all wanted me to tell y'all. Now, I'm back to tell y'all the stories y'all don't know about, all right? So, uh, reading the comments. I said I wanted to tell a story about uh, another story about when I got caught slipping in L.A. So I had to think about it, right? Because I was thinking, I don't think not, that, you know, I don't think I got caught slipping all the time in L.A. But when I thought about it hard, I was like, you know what? I did get caught another time slipping. So I'm gonna tell y'all that story, right? So uh, this time, I was staying in the car. Where was I staying at? Yeah, I was still we standing in the Carver's. Yeah. So, I was standing in the Carver's. And I told y'all, uh, like, you know, I used to wear this hat. And I used to wear my SF hat. And then I used to wear an Angel's hat. Now, I started wearing the Angel's hat because it was red. And I made it a, a, a click hat because... We got Avenue in our clique. So I made the A for Avenue. So I would wear the red A hat for Avenue. So I was at home and shit. Stayed in the Carver's. My brother pulled up and shit. He came in and shit. He was chilling. So he told me, uh, Want to come to the house with me real quick? Wait, what did he say? Uh, we was gonna go do something. I'm trying to think of how I went with him to uh to go to the, to his house or where he stayed at with my stepmother. Uh, but some I forgot what we was going to get. But he was like, uh, we uh, we go to the house real quick and then come right back. I'm like, all right. So I got in the car with him. We drove to L.A. Now my brother was from Forty Crip, from Dark Side Forties. And that's where he stayed at. <laughs> he stayed in the dark side of photos. So, uh, my brother pulled up. He parked, but he didn't even park. He, no, he did park. He parked the car, got out, and went in the house to get whatever the fuck he was getting. So, I'm sitting in the car with my red A hat on. And I had the music playing because he was listening to music when he got out the car. So the music was still playing. So I'm listening to the music and shit like this. You know what I'm saying? So my brother was in there for about like maybe like five minutes or something. So as my brother was coming out, I'm still sitting in the car. I looked up. I don't know why I just happened to look up at this time. I looked up and I seen my brother. And he was running towards the car. He was like, hey, cuz. No, nah, cuz, that's my brother. So when he said that, I looked like to the left because I I was looked to the right because my brother was he was in the apartments on the right. So I looked to the left, which was the street. It was a nigga, he had a 4-5 that he had, like basically had to my head, but he was putting it down because my brother said, that's my brother. He said, nah, cuz, that's my brother. So he was just putting the 4 five down like, like, this your brother type shit. So I'm looking like, what the fuck? This nigga was just finna smoke me type shit. So my brother run up, like run outside to the shit. He like, nah, cuz, that's my brother. He was like, oh, what's up, cuz? He was like, nigga, what's up? <laughs> The nigga who was finna shoot me was an older reputable nigga from 40s. But, uh, when the nigga, uh, was like, yeah, that's my brother, cuz. He was like, hey, all right, cuz. He was like, uh, uh, well, tell cuz, don't be wearing that hat in the hood, cuz. He was like, all right, cuz, I'ma tell cuz. He was like, all right. And he drove off and shit. My brother got in the car. He was like, shaking his head. He was like, damn, JD, so I forgot to tell you to take that motherfucking hat off when you came over here. 
Yeah, nigga, because I was like, nigga, this nigga was just finna drop a nigga, you feel me, real quick, nigga, with no questions asked, you know what I'm saying? He was finna blow a nigga shit back real quick while I was sitting in the car and listening to music. Wasn't gonna ask me where I was from or nothing, he was just finna smoke me, you feel me? My brother didn't come out at that time and run over there and tell this nigga, this my brother, you feel me? He would have dumped on me right there. So... That's another story time for y'all. It's quick, you know what I'm saying? But that's why I be trying to tell y'all. So every story time, they ask me about it. I'm going to be real quick, you know what I'm saying? So I need y'all to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, I need y'all to share it if you want to. If you don't, hey, it's, you know, not my problem. Uh, but uh, I need y'all to love God, love yourself, love your kids, and love your girl. All right.